here's a, something that might or might not be a concern to someone um, inspecting a property or thinking about purchasing a property. However, valves like these, these are sprinkler valves and they run off of a timer. Timer turns them on and off and they water your lawn. Well, maybe they aren't working or um, someone's not interested in keeping their lawn green either way. The point of this video is just to make it clear to you if you're thinking about purchasing a home and this is a high traffic area, you have sprinkler valves located in an area where people are going to be um, walking regularly and worse than that, moving furniture. And of course, this is the reason why you can imagine someone moving a large couch or a large object or even some boxes into the house and snagging on to these uh, valves and of course breaking them and you're probably thinking you know wait a minute I'm blowing this out of proportion but I want you to think for a moment think of who they call when um, something like this gets damaged I'm the guy that gets to come in and uh, wonder why in the heck someone put these valves here in the first place um, because they get broken, they people don't fix them, they end up watering the siding for a few years, and then I'm the guy that comes in and replaces the siding. All because why? Because someone put some sprinkler valves in an area where they shouldn't have. And like I said, you've got to cover as many possible bases as you possibly can. If you're inspecting a property and you see something like this, this isn't going to be a life or death situation, I should say, in most cases. It isn't going to be some. hey, you know what, everything in the house looks great except for those dang sprinkler valves. Why did they put them there? We're not buying the house. Hey, I am not about to suggest there aren't things you can do. You know, you could place two large rocks on each side of these things or build a box, put a pole in, do whatever. Um, or leave them there and just be extraordinarily careful, you know. Um, but uh, the main reason why I made the video was just to point this out. If you are inspecting a property and you see valves in a high traffic area or a potentially high traffic area, then this could be a problem in the future and lead to future home repairs.